Today I'll show you guys the difference between the three plans available at TradingView. I'll also show you guys which market data package do you need to get intraday data if you're looking to become a day trader or just follow the market very closely. Before we do that, just a reminder that all the tools I use to day trade are linked in the description. So without further ado, let's jump right in. So the first thing we're going to do is go into product and then we're going to go into pricing. So you have the pro, the pro plus and the premium. The pro over here, you can get five indicator per chart, two chart in one window and all the alerts over here. And it seems like there's a lot more into the pro plus, but it's actually pretty much identical. So when you look at this, you can see that you get two chart in one window over here and this one you actually get four and this one you actually get eight. So I'll show you guys the difference when I open up a chart. When you open up trading view, normally you have only one window like this. When you get the pro plan, you're going to be able to have two. And when you get the pro plus, you're going to be able to get actually four. And when you get the premium, you're going to get eight over here that you're able to get in one window. So the next thing is between the, all of these plan is the number of layout that you can save. So when you create one like this, you can actually make a copy over here. You can make a copy like this and you're going to have like a separate layout over here. So that counts for one layout that counts for two layout. When you get the basic plan, if we go back over here, you get five saved layout with the pro plus you get 10 and with this one you get unlimited so the next thing that makes a difference between all of these span is going to be the historical bars available basic you get 5k this one you get 10k 10k and also 20k over here so that only means that when you look at this over here you can go on like a one minute chart and go you're gonna get 20,000 bars so that means every candle counts as a bar so you're gonna get 20,000 on this one over here which is the premium when you get the other one you're just gonna get less you're gonna get 10,000 instead of 20,000 which is completely fine so the next difference is gonna be the alert you can see over here this one you get 20 this one you get 100 and this one you get 400 also the alert duration is a big difference so two month on this one two month two month and this one is unlimited so you can have something for like a year and this is good when you're adding some kind of alert to an indicator so i'll show you guys how you do this so we go to a daily chart and then we just click on it we say add alert and we're going to select crossing and the value is going to be example the 10 ema and we're going to leave this open ended so what's going to happen is it's going to alert us when the stock gets back to this level over here so the next thing we're going to do is look at the available markets so when you're getting trading view you're not going to get Get real time data your data is going to be 15 minutes late so if you're looking to get real time you're going to need to pick some market data and if you're looking to trade stock intraday these are the three that you're going to need nasdaq nyc and also arca you can also add otc if you're looking to trade the otc market i'm not so i'm only looking at these three market data package and you can see now it's nine bucks for all of them. So I hope this video is helpful. If it is, like and subscribe. Also, let me know what you want to see next in the comment section.